This is Jill and Hi, Tim Womack, Trees and Sea. We're in Raleigh, actually at Worthdale Community Center, and I got my bud, you've seen her before, Candace Brown. Candace, what are we up to? So we just finished doing a program today with the elementary school students here at Workdale Community Center. Uh, we just did an educational program about trees, um, the importance of trees, and what kinds of trees are here in their own yard. Uh, so. Well, what did they learn? I mean, what I, you were doing vocabulary in there that's so important. Yeah, uh -huh. so we learned about the parts of a tree, uh, trunk, leaves, all of that. We also came outside and had a nature walk and we learned about the different kinds of trees uh -huh. that are actually here just on the campus. And is this a big old tree tree right now? Well, what, what have you observed from this tree, Candace? What can you tell us about this tree? Uh, first of all, you got to look up. Look up and you'll learn so much more about your environment just paying attention to it. Yeah, we're under hangers right now. They call those widow makers up there. Those are dead branches that should have been cut. And let me tell you, you know, trees fail. That's one of those things. Uh, what about that Japanese back there, that, that cryptomeria, right? So, it's yeah, one of your so favorite you trees. Me, yeah, about the difference between this Japanese cedar tree and the eastern cedar tree. Uh huh. And the main difference between the two is, well, one, the trunks are different. There's two uh, trunks over here in the eastern cedar tree. Uh huh. One for the Japanese cedar tree. We learned about how that makes a difference in how the tree grows. And right. Well, the, you know what's happening over here. We'll walk over here real fast. See this beautiful cryptum area, and they've got incredible trees. All kinds of pines. They got, they've got uh, uh, sycamores out here. They've got sweet gums. But we're looking. We were trying to keep the kids about observing because when you come over here and see this eastern red cedar, you see these got these two codominants right here. And baby, is that going to be trouble? That's just going to wreak havoc as time goes on. So we're calling this an inferior tree. I'd go ahead and take it out right now would you yeah uh-huh well before we take a tree out we got more plans to do and what are we planning for next next we're planning for a big Arbor Day celebration on St. Augustine's University's campus uh, for the North Carolina Arbor Day March 22nd so look forward to for a video from that and we'll give you some more information between now and then until this this is Tim and Candace and we're saying goodbye and trees are cool right right uh-huh tree campus yeah jump on it trees tree without trees it'd be a sad world right you're right see you later y'all Bye.